Welcome back, legends, once again. I just played through this, but it seems my audio did not pick up the footage, so we're going to do it again. And we'll see how things go. We'll see if we can uh, get you guys through the episode without having some serious emotional breakdowns. <laughs> Which will be quite difficult. Where's Sir Roiland? He should be here. He should be there. The man values pride more than honor. We'll do without him. And without King's Landing. I know you'd hoped Mira could help us, but I'm confident we've enough strength of our own. Your men stand ready to act if needed. I hope so. You made mm. the right decision, my lord. Isn't this a lovely pile of timber? Not the place I'd want to be if there was a fire. Just to conch himself. Ironwood is near impervious to flame, my lord. Is it? May I introduce Lord Ramsay of House Bolton? Son of Roos Bolton. Although a bastard, Lord Ramsay has the full authority of Thank the Thank you, Lord no. That's enough. Hmm. Shut up, Whitehill. Fuck you. Who is this little boy? Is he lost? May I offer you bread and salt, Lord Ramsay? I loathe bread and salt. Of course you do. Aren't you the little lord? Lord Whitehall told me you were young. <laughs> this. Look at you. A token for the new warden of the north. Let me guess. Forrester Iron. Carved by our most skilled craftsmen. Ironwood doesn't look like much. No one can match our skill. Is that so? <laughs> Not bad. Lord Whitehill, can your lot do this? Given enough time, we could learn. Given enough time, you could do a great many things. Hmm. But not this, apparently. Look at that. More foresters. Lord Ramsay. Come out where I can see you. We really must focus on the business at hand. Leave them be, Lord Ramsay. Ah. Worried about your family. As you should be. I'm the Lord. I'll have you speak only with me. First. Let's see you bend the knee to my father, Lord. Oh, Lord. he is the Lord of the North. Lord. He is. Words are wind. Anyone can say they're loyal. My Lord. Ha! That wasn't so hard now, mm. was it? Here's the thing. Play the smart game. I don't care about your loyalty. The Crown, however, wants what you. Whatever you've been supplying the Starks for centuries. Ships, shields, chamber pots. I expect you'll do the same for us. My father has promised as much to the king. You wouldn't want to make him a liar, would you? That wouldn't reflect well on me. No, Lord Ramsay. That's a good little lord. You can't trust a forester. They murdered our men. It was a forest squire who did it. One Whitehill soldier dead. One bolt. Yet your man lived. No, you're mistaken. That's not how it happened. Our men are dead. How it happened is irrelevant. Then you welcomed me into your hall like a proper lord, hoping I wouldn't linger outside long enough to notice your pathetic little army. That sort of insolence from one of our Loyal bannermen. Hmm. Not to do. Fuck you. So I've come up with a solution that will benefit everyone. The White Hills will be taking control of your Ironwood from this day forward. What? What? The Ironwood? But 
That is our livelihood. Then you'd better well find another fucking job. You can't do that. Why not? You know something the Vitals don't? Yeah. We are talking about trees. You grow them, you cut them down. The White Hills had ironwood, once, but now those hills are bare. Hence the name, of course. They know nothing of how to cultivate the forest. Look at their sigil, my lord. A barren hill. Do you want ironwood for the next five years, or the next fifty generations? The little lord does have a point. We'll try this. Lord Whitehill will take half of your iron wood, and we'll see who fares better. But my lord... Half of something is better than the nothing you had before. Yeah, fuck you. To ensure there's no trouble, Lord Whitehill will install a garrison of 20 men within your walls. At Ironrath, that we cannot abide. Ethan. They'll help maintain the king's peace. And make sure there's no more trouble. White Hill men? Never. It's already done. Well, shit! You have a man you trust? I shan't. Griff. Griff will lead the garrison. You have no right. White Hills have no place here, lads. Do make this visit worthwhile. Please, Duncan, don't. Look at this little forester. You're not frightened, are you? Lord Ramsay, please. And you? Are you Lord Ethan's older sister? Oh dear. I'm his twin, my lord. Oh dear, oh, this is not going to be good. We're like the Queen and her brother. Well, hopefully not just like the Queen and her brother. I never had a sister. Always wanted one. Enough, Lord Snow. I have an idea. You'll come with me. You can be my highborn ward. Lord Ramsay, that's enough. Do you like hunting? Let her go. She's quite pretty, your sister. We get along well. <sighs> I suppose you can stay. Aren't you the bold lord? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> what the <laughs> shit? What? what he, done? he did a. What a. I don't want a bold lord. <laughs> what the? Far too much trouble. That cunt. Yes. No, no, no. Even though you did bend the knee. I think we've come to an understanding. Not even. I certainly feel better about all this. What have you done? However, the foresters need to keep their end of the bargain. Take the body of your lord. We'll have to do it again sometime. Somebody help him! Fetch the mace so quickly! You brought this. Stop! Don't let go! Let it go! Stop it! Don't stop it! Let it go! Do something! My son. He's fucking dead! What? No fucking way! Oh my god. Turns out that's the end of the season as well. Holy shit. Well guys, <laughs> I'll have to catch you in the next episode of Game of Thrones. Ethan sacrificed himself for us all. He saved Talia's life. He'll be remembered as Ethan the Brave. This house needs a leader. Lord Ethan named me Sentinel. I will lead this house. My sister asked you to swear loyalty to her son, and you did it without flinching. 
We can't let them hurt Ryan too. We have to stop them. We do not stand alone. There are those who will fight for us. Those who hold House Forrester above all other loyalties. Those who will not stop until Ethan is avenged. Until Ryan is home again, our house will not fall. We will be ready. Nothing comes without a cost, my lady. Are you prepared for what might happen?